Good afternoon to investors. Today it is the 16th of August 2023. Actually, one month and a half remain until the official, I want to underline official completion date. Because the last date is September the 30th, according to the business plan for the project. However, it has already become clear that we are not yet going to do everything by then, we will not have the time. But it's nice that we have a real chance to leave the outside territory and enter the building. This chance has become possible thanks to your activity and thanks to the promotion that is being held now. This promotion predetermined this activity. We can say that recently the flow of investments has been increasing and in August already, as of today, we can say that the receipt of investments to the Solomash account is a record. There has never been such a thing. This is a record. I bow low to you and thank you. It is only thank to you that all the processes take place on the site. No money, no work. There is money, there is work. Of course, we should not diminish the colossal role of contractors, specialists who work on the site. We should not depreciate their work, which is thorough, conscientious and high quality. Thanks to all these components, we can see what is behind my back. And what is behind my back? It is the inlet of heat supply to the administrative and utility building, or rather to the building of the future, Design and Technological Bureau. We are now in an individual heating point, where all the equipment is being piped. The work is going on quite dynamically and efficiently. The pace at which we are going now allows us to hope to hope that we will enter winter with warmth. We already have such a hope. It glows just like in 1941. There was a glimmer of hope for victory and success. Therefore, for our part, we will do everything that depends on us to make this happen. Because without what has happened to the receipts over the past a month and a half, it will be unrealistic. And now we even went so far as to unearth one of the passages. To be more precise, we unearthed the left entrance, because the availability of funds gives us confidence in the completion of these works. Because working with limited funds, when you don't have a single entrance to the territory, is risky, and you can't do that. Yes, fire equipment will pass here, but it is impossible to supply equipment. But I hope that within a few days these works will be completed in full. And no inspectors will be able to say that we do not have a temporary road. Because a permanent road should appear, I hope. A permanent road service will be made. And this is possible thanks to the funds that have been received. If they had not been there, the pace would have been completely different. You have seen in previous videos how events are developing on the site. You have seen how the territory has transformed before your eyes. Mountains of soil, mountains of reinforced concrete and other things disappeared. The territory is gradually acquiring a civilized appearance. And there is already a desire to level the lawn here. But it is not yet possible to do this, because there is cable laying of territory, lighting and telemetry. Also, a large amount of soil is being brought in for backfilling. 
Preparations are underway near the facade of the building. Work is being carried out to perform a puncture and it's reckless to take up a puncture in the absence of the necessary amount of funds to pay for these works. We need to be fully confident that having started the work, we will complete it. And we will complete it as soon as possible, because the work is very responsible and serious. It is also related to the fact that it will be carried out under the roadway of the Technopolis. The cameraman will now make shots of what work is currently taking place, what is being done, so that you can fully imagine what is going on here. One more thing I would like to say. Many people are trying to get a specific figure from me. How much it will cost, how much money is needed until the end of the work, before the design and technological bureau is put into operation. To be honest, I don't know, because no one has made estimates in advance. You can see the fluctuations of the exchange rate, price changes. As of today, the estimates that we have now, we have reviewed them, we have approved them, there are clear figures, clear volumes, we are working along them. But there are estimates that contractors make up and bring to us. They are considered by our planning and economic department. And we make comments, because sometimes contractors overestimate the cost by 40 or 60%. We cut estimates, we lower, we reduce, we check, we prove, we justify. This is a game and it is connected to the exchange rate, to the situation on the market, to the shortage, to the deficit. Therefore, it is not worth making price forecasts. But it is already clear that this facility will happen, despite everything. It has already practically happened. Well. Not yet, but it is clear that it will, and we have already started work on the production of a pilot batch of motors of the 100th dimension, which was incredible two or three years ago, but it has already happened, it is already a fact. It's not plans, but it's already a fact. And as always, we are only talking about facts. And the fact is that as of today, the receipt of investments to the Sovolmash account is a record. This is a fact. And the fact that more and more people believe in the project, it is also a fact. I think that there is nothing to object to this. Thank you all. Take care of yourself. Believe in yourself. And those who believe in us, participate in the project. Thanks again. The cameraman will now show you all the footage of what is happening in the project and see you again. Goodbye.